Now the On Your Side forecast with Steve Liebenthal. Very weak storm system moving through the northwest right now, not really bringing what many of us would like, which is snow. Just some cloud cover moving in. Things mixing up just a little bit here in the Treasure Valley. We have higher visibilities than we had last night, especially in the lower Treasure Valley, but this is not going to push the inversion out. The cloud cover moving in over the last several hours, and it's going to move right back out of the picture just as quickly as it moved in. We do see some snow falling across the Panhandle, down into the Clearwater Mountains. Looks like a little rain-snow mix around North Fork, Salmon, Idaho, but really not much happening. And for our viewing area from the West Central Mountains down into the Treasure Valley, just not much happening at all. 15 was our morning low in Boise today. 8 degrees was the low in Ontario. That cold air pooling up in the lowest part of the Treasure Valley. In Ontario, it only got up to 17 degrees this afternoon. 32 was the high in Boise. Twin Falls made it up to 45 degrees this afternoon. And in Bliss, it was 48 degrees late this afternoon, almost up to 50 degrees. The farther up you went in elevation, the warmer those temperatures got. High pressure coming in right behind this cold front. That means the inversion strengthening once again on Sunday and Monday, so expect the cold temperatures to continue. Some more fog in the early mornings of Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday morning. Then the next storm system comes in. Actually, this will start to move in Monday night and will move through Monday night and into Tuesday morning. Not much chance of any precipitation here in the Treasure Valley, but we could see a little bit of snow for the West Central Mountains Monday night into Tuesday morning, an inch or two possible, so don't expect much out of this. Dry and chilly for the next 24 hours. As you can see, any snow that's coming down, which is not much out of this storm system on the other side of the Continental Divide. Early in the week, this is pretty much Monday night into Tuesday, the potential of some snow showers for the West Central Mountains. We don't see much coming this far south into the Treasure Valley, so only a slight chance of some showers Monday evening in the form of rain, but again, the key word there is slight. In the West Central Mountains, morning lows on the chilly side down into the teens. Our afternoon highs not quite as warm as they have been. will be in the upper 20s to lower 30s. The Boise Mountains, a few locations getting into the low 40s, including Idaho City and Featherville. In the East Central Mountains, it's Sawtooth, morning lows also on the chilly side, 6 in Stanley, 15 in Sun Valley. Here, temperatures will not be quite as warm as they have been, only up to 33 degrees tomorrow afternoon for Sun Valley. In the Magic Valley, again, temperatures not as warm as they were today. 45 was the high in Twin Falls today, only up to 36 tomorrow. Morning lows will be mostly in the upper teens to low 20s. It will be a little bit breezy with the southwest wind at 10 to 20 miles per hour. In the Treasure Valley, partly cloudy in the morning, some patchy fog still around the lower valley. Afternoon highs will be mostly in the 30s. After morning lows, that will be in the teens. And my extended on your side forecast shows that fog making a comeback on Sunday morning. We'll see some of it tomorrow morning, but again, things have gotten a little bit better. The inversion strengthening through Monday morning before that next week storm system comes through. 10 to 20% chance of showers here in the valley. 30% chance of snow accumulating in the west central mountains of Idaho. Tuesday night, or rather Monday night into Tuesday morning, but again, only an inch or two possible. It's not what we're looking for. No. Uh, the good news is, I guess, New Year's Eve driving conditions sure. will be okay. No, that is good. Just more sunshine or at least snow if uh, we're not going to see Head sun. to the mountains if you want to get away from the inversion. Yeah. yeah. And show a lot of patience if you're looking for new snowfall. Yeah, it's hard, but that's what, what you're going to do. We're here. What are you going to do?